welcome to the key project. My name is Stephen Ablett and this is a collection of tricks which I've devised using normal keys and a couple of things you might put on your keys that you carry around with you every single day. It means you're always going to be ready for any impromptu effects, uh, anytime someone catches you in the street and they need to see a trick or if you're caught needing something at a pinch, these are great tricks to go to. You've probably seen me demo some of these live, but if you haven't, we'll go through a couple of them. This is a selection of keys which I carry around with me, mainly for gigs to be honest. <laughs> this is my gig set, but they've got a couple of things on there and I can do some of those tricks. This is Alex. Hi guys. Um, let me show you first, uh, let's get my keys out. We've, we're going to try something. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show a magic trick with you Alex. I've got one of these key pops here. Um, stuff it on it just yet, but I want to try something. Would you hold up your hand? Mm -hmm. Excellent. I'm going to ask you to hold on to it, mm -hmm. and I'm going to use my phone. I'm going to use my phone. I've got a picture here, a list of ten different objects. I can show the camera. We've got a flower, glasses, key, rabbit, dice, coin, jigsaw, puzzle, spoon, and hat. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'd like you to think of a number between one and ten. Don't yeah. tell me what it is. Give yeah. it a secret. Have a look at the list and see what items at your number. Uh, got yeah. It? Okay, got it. Cool. So you're focusing on that item. Mm -hmm. You're thinking of it. I want you to transmit the thoughts of whatever that item is into the key fob in your hand. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> you right. feel the impression burning itself mm -hmm. through your hand. Yeah. Is it? What is it you're thinking of? I'm thinking of a jigsaw. A jigsaw. Open yeah. your hand. Have you seen engraved now onto the key fob? Is a jigsaw, and you can check it out. Fully examinable. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Mhm. Mm well, I've got you. I'm going to try. We'll get rid of that. I'm going to try one more. Uh, we we'll use this key pop. Uh, firstly, check it out. You can see. Blank. Right, yeah. We're going to leave it there for a moment. Mhm. Mm go that way. <laughs> I'm going to try something. I'm going to give you an invisible pack of playing cards. Mm -hmm. What do you give them a good shuffle? Yes, I can about the box. You've heard the line. Yeah. Okay. Oh, you dropped one here. Yeah. I've got that other back in there. That I drop them all the time. Excellent. I'd like you to split the cards between picture cards and number cards. So just deal through them. Put the number cards and picture cards in two different piles. So put all the picture cards there and all the number cards here. Okay. So picture cards and number cards. Mm -hmm. Pick one of the piles up. Okay. We're going to get rid of these number cards and throw them away. So that gives us the Jack, Queen and Kings. Deal those out. Kings, Queens and Jacks. Excellent. Mm. Perfect. Uh, would you pick up two of them? Put the Jacks and the Kings. Throw them away. We're left with the Queens. We've got Queen of Hearts, Queen of Diamonds, Queen of Clubs and Queen of Spades. Do you like black or red? Red. Red. So we're going to take the red and we'll throw the black away. Queen of Hearts and Queen of Diamonds. Queen of Hearts and Queen of Diamonds. Diamonds. Diamonds, but throw it away. So we're left with one card. Mm -hmm. Queen of Hearts. The key pop, which I showed you at the very beginning, if I turn it over, you'll see it now says the Queen of Hearts on that key pop. Yeah. <laughs> it's firmly on there. You can check it out. I've not switched it, no shells. And you can check it all out. Mm -hmm. Well, I thought, yeah, there's the key, there's lots of tricks you can do with these key fobs. Uh, we'll go through that later. Let me show you a few other things with my keys, though. The benefit of uh, this particular project. I have no numerous items here. If I take off these two keys to begin with. Okay. We've got a yellow key and a red key. Well, the two silver keys, but the, they have these key fobs on. So you can see one of them's red and one of, them, uh, one of them's white. Okay. Would you hold up your hand? I'm going to place both keys in your hand. Would you close your hand around them? Turn your hand over. I'm going to reach in and take out one key, the one you're thinking of. Are you thinking of one? No, I wasn't. Think of a colour. Think of a colour. Red. Don't tell me, don't tell me. Oh. You're thinking of one. Okay. Okay, the one you're thinking of, is it the white one? No. Well, don't worry, we can fix that. We can fix that. I can say this white key. Wave it around your hand and it turns into the red key. Open up your hand and now you have the white key. Mm -hmm. We can take it a step further. We take both of those keys, the red and the white. If I was to place one, uh, if I was to take this white key, place it into my pocket, do you know which one's in my hand? The red one. That's the white one. 
We'll try something else. Well, we can even make this white key, and if I was to place it into my hand here, uh, would you hold on to it? And we can make yeah. it vanish like so. It's a little key sequence of routines that I do with those two keys.